Hello, I'm back today to show you a comparison um, between MoU's XL plates and their non-XL plates. Um, for some of their designs, MoU has um, uh, what they call XL images, which are larger for if you have larger nails or longer nails. And for the rest of them, they are not. They are the um, in a non-XL format. And you want to know which ones you're buying because um, it can make the difference of whether or not you're going to cover your whole nail or not. Um, in a couple of their plates, in particular um, this one, which is Explorer 17 versus Explorer 02, they have some of the same images in both of the XL and the non-XL sizes. So I mentioned in a video that I haven't posted yet, so when I do post it, you're going to have to kind of pretend that we're doing a time warp thing. Um, I said that maybe I would get both of these plates and show them to you so you could see the difference and I decided to do that and that is just purely out of the kindness of my heart and nothing to do at all with me wanting some lame excuse for owning both of the plates. So here you can see these are the same images right here um, and in the XL plate you can see how much bigger it is here than the non-XL plate and let's see if I can get real creative and fancy here and also throw in the Conad plate. So you can see that the non-XL image is closer to the standard Conad size. In fact, it looks like it's a little bit smaller, maybe just a tiny bit smaller um, in terms of height than the standard Conad. Um, and the XL is definitely bigger than the standard Conad. So this gives you an idea. Um, I'm also, I'm, I will also put up my finger here. Actually, let me put up this one. Even though it's upside down, that's the scarab from this little guy here. You can see how this scarab from the XL plate would have uh, covered my entire nail from top to bottom, and I wouldn't have had space for that little pattern at the bottom if I had wanted it. But if I did want something that covered the full nail, then that would have been uh, perfect for me. So let me show you a couple of the other ones. There is um, the Nefertiti or Nef you know, Nefertiri. Not sure exactly who she is. The lovely, beautiful woman there. Uh, and then there's the cartouche-ish kind of thing. Um, and then you can see, for example, the difference in sizes between uh, the camel. So you can see that if I wanted to try to get the whole camel image with the mount, with the pyramids and the sun, I'm going to have much better luck doing that on my little nubbins if I have the XL plate, where if I have, you know, longer nails, maybe I'm going to want this to get more coverage over the full nail. And even these are not super long compared to what a lot of people have. Okay, so because the XL plates are bigger when you're looking on their site, they're normally going to be positioned like this horizontally across the plate. And in the non-XL plate, they're going to be pointed up. They're going to be following the long edge and pointing up towards the short edge of the plate. Uh, one of the other things that's important to note is because these images are bigger, the plate fits fewer images. And because these are smaller, they fit more. So on this plate, you actually have a few additional designs. So in addition to the Ankh and this one with um, the Eye of Ra, you have, um, or Horus, depending on your preference, and the Kitty, and your little pattern here. And you've got your Scarab, and you've got your... Um, your king or your, I guess this would more likely be like a, a court priest, uh, your death mask, and I love the maze with that, um, pyramid, your cartouche, your pyramid with your eyes. So all of those are also on the XL plate. They're just a little bit bigger. But these are not on the XL plate. So these are only on this um, smaller plate. And you've got kind of a, an Egyptian flowery bush pattern. Um, the, a different kind of flower with um, some Egyptian symbols. The lotus pattern, which I have on um, upside down, sorry. So you can see I've used this, but um, just to give you a sense of what that looks like there. And of course, my manicure will be up on, I will link the manicure in my post. And then you have a different kind of scarab here and a sort of a looks like a feathery design, but I, you know, kind of a jeweled headdressy sort of design. And this looks like an abstract scarab slash um, uh, flower to me. So you get 
six additional images on this. Of course, the problem is, is that if you have longer nails, these may not suit your purpose. So the point of this video is just to help you be able to make an educated decision about what you want. Um, and if you're like me, maybe you decide you want them both um, to be able to use for different things. But this way you kind of know and have a little bit of comparison when you're making the decisions between your XL plate and um, the non-XL images uh, for the designs that at least have uh, some overlapping designs from both of the plates. You will also see me doing an additional video on Explorer 2 along with uh, another one of their Egyptian themed plates. Uh, so I will be back before too long with that, but for now I will link the images from these um, onto my blog along with the size comparison and I will put the manicure that I did using um, this plate. Okay, thanks for watching.